Good afternoon, Keller Williams, and welcome back to the Command 66 Day Challenge 2.0, Day 27. Today, I want to talk to you about one of the new smart plans that the KW Labs team has released for us to use within KW Command. So there's actually two of them. We're going to talk today about the Midterm Nurture Smart Plan. So in order to access that smart plan, you want to get into your Contacts panel and come to one of your contacts. Again, we'll use AA Seller as our test contact. And I can see on my contact record, if I go over to the right hand side, Smart Plans, I can see that this contact has already been added to the bi-weekly neighborhood nurture, meaning that they're getting an email every two weeks from me uh, with their neighborhood nurture campaign kind of set up. They're getting uh, this link, right? I can preview it, we won't go through all of it, but it'll be an email basically showing them their neighborhood pages where they can click and see homes for sale, they can click and see neighborhood stats, etc. Now, if I click on Add to Smart Plan, I'll see that we now, instead of having only three, we actually have five neighborhood, or excuse me, five smart plans available. So midterm nurture, long-term nurture, quarterly call plan, and in addition to bi-weekly and monthly neighborhood nurtures. So today we're gonna to talk a little bit about the midterm nurture. Tomorrow we're gonna to talk about what the long-term nurture looks like. So the best way that I have found to kind of view the steps that are included in one of your smart plans is to view the Kelly Guide. Now this does take several steps. However, you only have to do it once in order to see what the steps are going to be for that particular smart plan. And then you'll kind of know who you wanna get added to it and who you wanna get added to other smart plans. So we're just gonna kind of come through and click next. We've done this before, checking on all of our marketing, making sure that everything looks good. The nice thing is here, we used to have to click continue and then actually type in our, our email. They've taken that out. So that was a little bug that's now been uh, removed. So that's nice. So if we scroll down here, you can see these are all of the enabled smart plans right now. And here is the midterm nurture. So basically the midterm nurture says it's a general check-in with a recently met contact to offer your expertise for something real estate specific. Motivate your messaging around their needs. It shows that it's a six step smart plan that should run anywhere from three to six months. And the goal is to convert contacts. If I click on view steps, I can come down and actually see the entire smart plan and the steps that it will go through. So when you put somebody on this smart plan, it immediately adds them to the bi-weekly neighborhood nurture. So you don't need to do a midterm nurture and the bi-weekly neighborhood nurture. You can just choose one or the other because putting them on the midterm nurture will automatically add them to the bi-weekly neighborhood nurture. What it's gonna do is add them to that so they'll get an email and then it's gonna delay two weeks and then it's gonna send you an alert to call this contact for check-in. So it'll actually show up on your Kelly. You'll get an alert that morning. It's usually 9 a.m. Central Standard Time. Uh, at least that's what it is for me that I get an alert from Kelly saying, what are my uh, tasks for today? It's gonna to delay two more weeks and then it's going to ask you to send a text to check in with the client. Now this is not automated. It does not automatically send that text. It's just an alert to have you send the text. And then it's gonna repeat. So it'll wait two more weeks and it'll give you an alert to make a phone call. We'll wait two more weeks, give you an alert to send a text. So basically you're touching base with that client via email every two weeks and then via either phone or text every two weeks as well, just to try and stay in front of them and convert them into a possible buyer or seller. So that is the midterm nurture smart plan that has recently been added. In order to add a contact to that smart plan, I can go through the Kelly guide by clicking on add contacts. And then I can search for name. Here's our AA seller. Um, I could sort by first name, last name. I could choose tags if I wanted to add everybody in my database that was a potential buyer, potential seller, etc. I could put everybody on that smart plan. For right now, I'm just gonna show you what it looks like to add AA seller. I'll click on add to smart plan. It'll take a couple of seconds to get that added in and then it'll show one contact was added to the smart plan queue. So I can X out of that. I can click next, take myself all the way out and then I can go back into command. Whoops, excuse me. Best way to get in probably just to go to one of these three. So I can just click on IDX. It's gonna take me back to the command panel. I can go into contacts. And then it was double A seller. Let's just verify that he has been added. I click on smart plans and sure enough, here is the midterm nurture. And now I told you that it, adding someone to the midterm nurture also adds them to the bi-weekly neighborhood nurture. So here's my only concern is that if you add someone to a midterm that's also already added to a weekly, bi-weekly, 
they're going to get an email on the 23rd and every two weeks from there, and then an email on the 27th and every two weeks from there. So my recommendation would be to go ahead and remove them from the bi-weekly neighborhood nurture because this midterm nurture in and of itself has the bi-weekly nurture included. So that way they're only on that smart plan and you're not blowing up their email box every five days, seven days, eight days, whatever that may be. That's pretty much it, guys. Day 27 of the Command 66 Day Challenge. As always, it's a pleasure speaking with you. Hope you're having a fantastic weekend and I will look forward to speaking with you in the morning.